don't think oh. the same. We don't act the same. That's so, all that is. Okay, so question. We have a microcosm of women. What 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 do you guys actually think about what Fatty just said? Is that is that shit happening? Do you have experience that that can verify? I you guys understand? Happens. Go ahead. It ha it happens, but I I don't think that that's the standard. I don't think that that's normal. I think that's a small group of women who do do it, but it, it definitely happens. But Mr. you're saying uh, that's the minority. Yes, yeah. yeah, it's the minority. Yes, definitely. Patty, I have a question. Yes, me. Are you, are you saying that? Are you saying that that's something that's? Are you saying that that's our nature as women? Yes, he's designing you. One of the most powerful tools for men to attract women is they being validated by another woman. Let me tell you what I used to do when I was younger. I used to go. I'm six two, and I used to go on the nightclub with a woman that was almost my height. A beautiful woman, just my friend. I wasn't trying to fuck her, but she makes me look so good. I would go to the nightclub with her. I would have some drinks and all that. I would go around my friends. They would see me with her. I would go early home, and then afterwards, on the next day, I had a bunch of calls from women that were on the same nightclub that saw me with that beautiful woman, and now they are curious because they, oh, you have a girlfriend? I didn't know you had a girl. No, no, no. She's just my friend, and now they are all in competition because I prove to them. That I can get the high quality woman in terms of look. This is the oldest trick in the book. This yeah. is the old is is you inviting beautiful girls to your section, and now that everybody sees with beautiful girls, other girls want to fuck you because they think those girls that are on your section are trying to get at you. It's yeah. it, it, it's yeah. basic. Is that all bad? Is there all these bad things? I mean, no, it, it makes no, no, it, 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 it's, 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 he's expounding it's, on the competition, like when yes, it's the women see it. That's, that's, that's why they say women. For, for context, real quick. How tall are you? Who? You. Six two. Yeah. So the girl he with, like, looking like a stallion in that motherfucker. Yes. <laughs> so. And everybody can see because she's taller than everybody on the crowd. She has the like woman on the especially tall woman are kind yeah, of. No, no. Yeah, I just wanted to make sure they understood the whole picture. Yeah. So. yeah, women women make the best wingman. Um, but let me let me say this to the point of what Fatty said, and I I, I want it before I lose it from what Dana said. And Dana, this isn't personal, but I'm I'm taking it from what you're saying, and I think you speak for a lot of women um, that just either don't realize or just don't want to understand that, yes, you are, and yes, you will, because there is a man, you have a type, you have a certain type of man that you're going to entertain, a certain type of man that you like, be it his looks, be it his income, be it his personality, be it whatever, and if and when you find that man, you want that man. You don't want the man you don't want, correct? Do you want a man you're not attracted to? Do you want a man that's broke? Do you want a man that's undesirable? No, of course you don't. So again, when you say that you're not competing for a man, it's just you not acknowledging what we've been trying to tell y'all all night. You're always competing because at some point, the man you want more likely than not, especially if it's a man that is pre-selected, like Fatty said, when you talk to women, like I said, the 80-20 rule, states that most women find most men unattractive so the man the men that a lot of women find attractive all women are going to be drawn to that man height body composition you know he's in shape musculature athletic all this stuff like that you know then of course you know he has a sense of humor good personality um his money's together he's not some bum that man right there is a one percent man you know what i'm saying and i'm not and people like to talk about just the finances again man if you're over six feet you, you know what I mean? You got, you know, six, 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 six guy, you know, all the sixes. Like, you are a guy. You don't have to be an NBA player. You don't have to be a Fortune 500 company owner. You just hit so many of the wickets that where a lot of women are going to want you. So any woman that deals with you can lie to herself and say she's not competing, but then she's just being unrealistic and she's not accepting the fact of that she has to compete because you're a highly desired man. And men know this. Because that's why men like um Chad the Osa, what Osa said, if you're a guy that you know what I'm saying have your option to have your way with women, the women you deal with are always gonna be in competition, you know what I'm saying? And and more likely than not, they know that. If they if and they'll just be lying to themselves if they act like they didn't. Just saying. even even to keep your relationship fantastic. The best way to keep a woman is by she knowing that she can be easily replaced by other woman. They uh, act their better way when they know there's competition around. This Let me read so these. Weird. 
I love to tell us how we feel and how we think and how we move. Like that shit is so bizarre. Yeah. That's what the lion does to the gazelle. He knows how they move and where they go. There's we are hunters. The lion knows where the gazelle goes and what okay. he does. And, and a lot of this is a lot of this is psychological. Also, I mean, you can you can read them studies on this and all these. Let me read these super chats. Real quick. My bad, my bad, him. Yeah, let me read these. Eighties, eighties, baby Dre was popping. My boy with the ten ounces. I'm gonna be honest. I tune out of um this show, but Hamp show is different. Although you still got the hyenas on the show, you still challenge them and ask pertinent questions that make for a good show. Shout out to Latif. We had a good time over there a couple weeks ago. Um, Omac with the five dollars says both men and women sides are in competition with each other. Men showcase that they are better men, and women show that that are the most beautiful. Okay. Stepping wolf with the two dollars says life is a competition, the game never stops. Red Pill Ranger with the five dollars says women think that women think they have to agree to compete for it to be so. LOL. The moment you enter the dating market, you are competing with every woman that is in it. John Henry with the ten ounces. This is not a different conversation. Speaking anecdotally doesn't change the fact that women want the same type of man who's successful, competent, achieving, productive, and successful. The Red Pill Ranger with the Fellow says, I'm going to need the sisters to think outside themselves and their circle and what they would do and understand. It's over 4 billion women in the world. Hank Deasy was popping sitting with the $2, $2 Super Chat says, sending love to Hamp and the panel. Salute to you, bro. Hope all is well. John Henry with the Fellow says, Competition is a good is good for sexual marketplace. There is not this perfect person meant for anyone, only the opportunity to compete for someone. The Red Pill Ranger with the five dollars says Dana don't like the word competition because of her ego and the fragility of it. You don't have to consider competition or and still lose. To with the two dollars says, We don't make y'all compete, we just point it out. Ali with the ten dollars says camp. Hamp, Ro, Dana, and that other girl who asked about my meat was fighting over me on the first time I was on your show. They literally started fighting. God, <laughs> Ro was going to fly me out in them friendly skies. I wasn't even on that show. Yes, you were. You came in no, late no, and you started to feel the prey from love. I was no, there. I saw okay. it. Kev you C came in on a parachute. What's up, Mr. Kev, with the Honduran 75, which is probably equivalent to like five bucks or so. Shout out to Mr. Kev. Shout out to Trigger Mike. He's the steady voice of reason everywhere he goes. Big up, DJ Hamp. Love the show. And great new year to all. Appreciate you. Be safe over there. You heard? Red Pill Ranger with the 2000 says, it's literally more women on the planet than men. Um, Google it. Uh, Red Pill Ranger with the 2000 says, Trigger Mike for president. Oh, Mac, with the five dollars says, lady, if you are over 35 and feel like you don't have to compete, you are delusional. You are in delusional land. Your chances of getting married are very low. Red Pill Ranger with the five dollars says, how can, a, how can a man make a woman feel like she has to compete? When did when did we, wait, when did we get mutant mind control powers? Zero accountability of their choices slash actions. Harambe Jack was popping my brother with the five dollars says, but Patty, but Patty, but you mean Fatty? Yeah, yeah. Some some people can't say Fatty because the Google the, oh, the okay. it doesn't allow it to use. It won't allow it. But yeah. Fatty Pete Davidson has a huge ellipsis ego, according to Ariana, Kim, Kate Beckinsale, etc. It's not his looks. He's a male version of a pass around. Hmm. Rebel Rosa says Fatty is right. I used to do the same thing, bro. The standard L R L C was popping with the final says. The competition is that you want to have the man you want before someone else takes him off the market. It's a race, and he's the finish line. Dana, you were expounding on how men know much about what women want? No, not about what women want, about how we think, how we feel, how we move. I just, um, I was just making the point that you all never listen to what we're actually saying and what our point of view is. You just tell us how we feel, how we think. And I'm sitting here and telling you the exact opposite, but it's still not resonating because you have your own ideal. It, because again, y'all love to pin us against each other, and that's just not. It's just not it, the case. It's not because of I that. Can't, I can't compete with somebody, and also call myself the prize. I'm the prize to me, so I don't need to compete. I'm not hunting. I'm not looking for somebody. I'm not pursuing. So I'm Can not we, in competition. I am the prize. Oh. 
Hold can on. we play a game? Hold on. So, so can we can we just do a thing one on one? Let and me at group least group. see if some of the other women want to say something real quick. Let me just see. Go so ahead. Real, real quick, I want to say this. If you want to say compete, y'all men, then that's fine. But it's like I'm being the best version of myself. That's what I'm doing. I'm not buying new lashes because she has nice lashes. I'm not buying that outfit. I am being the best version of myself because guess what? Men don't like a lot of makeup. Men do like a lot of makeup. They want to look a certain kind of way. You know, so it's, it's like we're being the best version of ourselves because that man that wants me is going to want me and not this false contrived version of myself because I'm competing to be better than this other woman. What if he finds a bad deal? What if your best version of herself is not enough because there's a better deal? I'm sorry, honestly, say one more time. I'm sorry, say one more time. What if the best version of Fatty is not enough because DJM offers a better deal? Are you going to get with me because I'm the best version of myself? Or are you going to get with M because he offers a better deal that I can give you? I want the best man for me. You didn't answer my question. That's, no. a, that's, a, that's a finesse. Bro, that's a, don't, don't, don't overrun them for a second, fellas. Don't overrun them for a second. Oh, okay. um, let's let's just think about this. Go ahead, go ahead, answer this question. Then I got a couple questions to consider before you guys jump back in. Okay, go so ahead. so you're What's saying up, the best Daddy versus the better version of Ham. Yes. The point is, you can be the best version oh, of I do that love. Let me clear it out. Love Ham or or vice versa doesn't no, matter. Let me clear it out so you can understand what I said. Right? I will go on a self love journey. I want to be the best version of myself. I go to the gym. I try to get more money, a better house, a better car, all that. And I think the love will get me. Well, love will search for me because I'm the better version of myself. And now comes Amp, better looking, better house, better car, more articulate, better father. Are you going to take me because I'm the best version of myself? Or are you going to pick M that he might not be the best version of himself, but he offers a clearly better deal than what I can get you? Why are you going to West? Things right there can fade, Fatty. And if I'm about you and you represent the best version of you, I want you. There's always gonna be somebody, there's always gonna be something better than you. There's gonna be somebody like, body finer than you. There's gonna be a man taller than you. That's what I'm saying. It's a it's not just hey. outward. Hey. Can, can, no, I, uh, no, can I go ahead? No. Go ahead. Go yeah, ahead. I got you. I got you. You know, I got go you. Ahead. Um, love. Wait. Here's here's the thing about the hypothetical. You have these two options in front of you, right? You know, and you get to choose, right? So, if we answer the question logically, you're gonna choose the better deal, right? That's what he's presenting there, because yes. what you said can happen to both of them, where things will fade. But now, just imagine. Fatty has hit his ceiling. I'm better than him, and I'm not the best version of myself yet. It wouldn't even make sense to pick exactly. him. But Fatty said you have the better car. He named all these materialistic things. No, no, he was said just everything. He was, he was, he was talking about the better oh. man. Yeah, don't, yeah. Because here's the thing. Here's and here's. No, I heard, I hear what you said, car love. But I know you heard everything. The reason why I know you heard everything is because you said those things fade fade you wouldn't be referencing a car when you said fade right so you right. were talking about looks and etc so you heard everything he said right so so if you were answering it logically you would pick me because it makes the most sense to do so in the hypothetical i'm not talking about fade. I'm talking about the car can go away the car does not make a man that's what i was talking about like I'm literally being sincere in this. I'm not understanding why I'm getting head shakes and everything else. Like Hang that. on. I think I know what you're talking about. I know. I, just, give me, just give me a second. I know what she's talking no. about. I know I what mean, she's talking about. I know, give me yeah, just, yeah, a minute, just a minute. Just a minute. Just a minute. You're saying you're she, you, it's better. I got one more question. You're not going to over. Come on. This ain't that. You already know. So, so okay. So, she's saying that she would pick the option that's be not better, even if she has a choice, and she knowingly knows that that option hit the ceiling. Okay. But that's it but just, that's but not it, what Fatty. That's not what Fatty said, though. You are taking what, what he said. said. He said that though. Hey, that's what I'm saying. I'm saying back to you exactly what he said, and that's why I'm saying now that I've clarified. Hopefully, what's your answer? Let's just do it like that. What's your answer? In lamest term, the better man. Hamp is the better Nobody man. Nobody always Hold picks on, the better say, man. Don't overrun it. Don't overrun it. She can answer, and we can we can move from it because it. Let me see. Go ahead, go ahead, love. So, if you're presenting 
two same people, two same outlooks on life, same everything. Okay. But you come, I'm asking a question, please. Okay, okay, okay. Y'all are the same. Hmm. I knew Fatty first, though, and, and you're offering the same exact thing he's offering, but you come in taller, you're saying, and you come in offering more things than him, then yes, I would I would pick you because you're the best version of yourself, right? But and y'all are offering the same exact things. That is that what we're talking? No, about? he's not the best version of himself. <laughs> <laughs> I'm literally you, 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 know, you, know, you guys <laughs> gotta under you guys gotta understand. You, you guys are dealing with her in the wrong way. Like it, that doesn't that work. Her, so I'm just saying. Yeah, so that's what I'm saying. Let me do it because we talk to each other every goddamn day. So he already hit his ceiling. I'm better than him, and I'm not even there yet. Regardless if you knew him first, you have both options. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And I got all the shit he got. And you didn't hit your ceiling yet. And you still have potential to grow still. I'll, I'll but, pick you then. And you know why? Because the best version of you or him, that ain't going to cut it. Good enough. Yes. And you that, the that was the point he's making. You know? Yes. And men do the same. I'm not trying to sing a lot to him. I will say the same. If, if a woman is the best version of herself, but another woman offers a clearly better deal. She cooks better. She cleans better. She's more affectionate. She's more loyal. Yeah, I got you, bro. After fatty. I have a question. Yeah. And that's fine. All right, Joker, but ask your question to let Black Dragon get in. He want to come in and, and clarify everything. Go ahead. So I have a question for, for, genius, Dan, for Love and Dana. Um, did you get, you guys went to college? Yes. How did you choose? How did you choose the college that you went to? What made you choose those um, schools? Love you. Want to go? I'll go first. So I chose my first degree. I chose that because it was close to home, um, and it they offered me some money, um, and I had a child, so I just had to do what's convenient for me. Okay. I chose my, mine based off of the career that I wanted and um, looked up who had the best schools for that particular degree that I wanted to pursue. And I knew that I wanted to go to an HBCU. So I factored all of those things in and made my decision to go. Okay. Would you say that um, since, you, since you had an outcome, a desired outcome, right? And you needed to put things into place in order to achieve your desired out outcome would you say that the colleges that you had to choose from would you say that they were in competition i'm um, not go ahead, yeah, i'm not sure i'm just, I'm just go ahead i'll let her clarify then so uh, i'm asking you joke a bit am i saying it mm -hmm. right a bit joke, joke a bit yeah joke joke a bit. so you're saying the university that i went to were different universities fighting for me to, to attend? Is that what you're asking? They are competing in order to get your business, yeah. Oh, okay, you're, okay, that. Um, so you chose, there, there are multiples there, yes. There are multiple universities. Yeah. There. Yeah. Yeah. And you, cho you chose the best, um, you, you made the, be the best choice based on what you wanted for you, for the outcomes that you wanted, the desired outcomes that you wanted. Not because they were the best colleges, or because they were the best, you know, it's because it's what you wanted. It was the best fit. The, be the best fit, right? It was. Yeah. So what if there was a college that didn't really, like, like how did you even know about these colleges? Did they do, did they market? Did they, no, I did they didn't it. market? You did the research mine yourself? I'm sorry? I, I said, no, mine didn't market either. I, I didn't have to really research it, but because it's, it's just a well-known school, um, but I I did research on um, like I oh, said right. the, the track that I wanted to take. But I I I hear the point that you're trying to make, but I'd rather you just make the point than ask us questions to make it for you. So if you don't mind, well, well the point is in asking the okay. All right, all right, let's do this. <laughs> uh, well, Black Dragon, you ready? Let me just. I only got a few, bro. Um. KG Kennels with the five dollars. Yo, bro, I was just I meant to text you today. Word is born. And one of the kids woke up and distracted me, bro. I, I was thinking about you today. Like, yo, I ain't seen you in a minute, B. Shalom, bro. Hope all is well. Been working seven days a week for like a month now. Just showing support. Salute, bro, man. You gotta get some rest, B. But I know the grind is real. Devin 
Devin with the two dollars. What's popping? Devin said, "Faith without works is dead." dead. <laughs> Harambe Jack, what up though? With the twenty dollars says, "There aren't more women on the planet. There are more women in Western and egalitarian societies." Anywhere there is a billion or more population, the ratio is two to one, male to female. China, India, etc. Stop spreading misinformation. Lauren, Lauren with the town says, "Drop EBD for the lack of respect for the hoes and ladies." <laughs> Why is he dropping? Nah, he be chilling, man. Yo, come on, man. You keep talking, man, and you shut the fuck up. Huh? Black Dragon to be back at 11.53, man. Lauren, he wasn't saying nothing. <laughs> History with EGA Wade was popping with the files. The two, the 38-year-old women, I'm not, I am 39. I'm not talking to 38-year-old women. I'm talking to 25 to 33 Filipina women. Okay. Young Reckless with the files. There's more women. China slash India only have more men. Oh, there's more in China and India only have more men. The Red Point Ranger with the ten dollars says, "Bring back Black Dragon. He's you in. Oh, what? Wrong one. Like He's back like he never left, man. <laughs> Enos with the two dollars, a two pound says, "It's not that deep, love. Why? Damn, man. That's Shout it. out to John Henry. Been showing love and support all day, man. He also hit the panel this afternoon. He had a great comp. Where the fuck is Nick? All right, Fatty, you ready? I'm not. The gangsters don't dance. They oh. lean with it. Rock with it. Put, put <laughs> put, just put do that. On my spot. Just, just, then just do that. I won't dance. No. <laughs> I thank you, Larry. I appreciate you. Thank you for the support. Weather outside is humid. She turned up her location. She must think I'm stupid. She want to run the street, so let her hold, let her hold, let her hold. She doesn't show signs of stopping. So who am I to be cop blocking? I really hate to see you go. Let her hold, let her hold, let her hold. John Henry with the 50 ball. Dana, we listen just not to anecdotal perspective. The best version of ourselves doesn't come from self-assessing our own selves while home alone and then becoming annoyed when someone doesn't share the same perspective. It's called reference mm, mm, mm. black dragon was popping they tried to get you out here but they couldn't do it man you got the floor I got right, so I'll, I'll be real quick with it so i think the he question I, yeah they already uh, drop him drop him drop him i'm snitching yeah, yeah, right. i already got him out of there damn oh, <laughs> Your money. <laughs> he said, Lauren Mack with the 20 ball said, Nah, cuzzo, EBD Damn. needs to rest his throat. Oh, my God. Lord, God. God. Damn, I got one more then. Oh, Mac with the five dollars, so he'll be back at 12 05. We still here. Oh, Mac with the five dollars says, All women practice hy hypergamy around the world. Black women just takes it to a whole other level that is very unrealistic. Black women must adjust to, to what you qualify. Yeah, so let me let me a couple of things. So there are more women on and then men on the planet. It's like fifty one to forty nine. It's not a lot. It's not a big thing. It's the same thing in the U.S. It's like a fifty one to forty nine split. Everybody think it's like this whole, huge surplus yeah. of women to men. It's not that that big of a number when you're looking at billions upon billions of people. Um, now again, I I don't want to I guess talk about that or whatever. I'll just say this. Listen, when everybody else is saying it. And you can have your perspective. You can have your thing. Um, I know if men aren't trying to force women to do anything. The thing is that y'all, I, I say this and I stand on this. Men understand women a whole lot better than women understand men. And women are far more, um, I'm, excuse me, far less um, honest and transparent as men are. Men can get up here and be candid and say a lot of shit that, you know what I'm saying, probably shouldn't be said. But who gives a fuck? Because, again, if you're going to fuck with me, you're going to fuck with me. I'm not going to hold my tongue because I'm in fear of not being able to get a woman to like me or something. Cause I mean, I'm me, but the thing is that women will be very, very coy. That's why it's a lot of, a lot, a lot of, you know, I guess processes and trying to understand things 
that are clearly stated. Don't be passive aggressive, sir. If you got something to say, say it. I, I, I the love. I've already told you, baby. No, you it is, well it is, it is, say it right now. Process forever, love. If I understand it, then I'm gonna get clarification. I'll say it again. I'm not being wait, 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 wait. love. Don't why did you hold on? I, 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 Mr. I said it before. But Mr. Fitzat, didn't you just pull a Dana? Who? You said they like you because you, you, the women. That's all Dana said. These niggas like no, me because no, no, she no, 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 that's not what Dana said. That, that, and if you oh, let right. me elaborate, maybe I'm no, yes, no, no, they don't. They don't like Dana. No, no, no. It is what she said. She said I'm just gonna be myself. I'm just gonna be me. They like no. me for me. No, 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 no. No, again, that's two different things. And then, like I said, let me elaborate. Dana said oh, that. Before Dana you elaborate, the other outside is humid. She turned up her location. She must think I'm stupid. Oh. She wanna run the street, so let her ho, let her ho, let her ho. She doesn't show signs of stopping. So who am I to be cop blocking? Oh I really hate to see you go. Let her ho, let her ho, let her ho. And Wolf with the fifty ball, he said, "Bring EBD back." <laughs> Go ahead, man. Clarify, man, because I think you just pulled a Dana. No, no, I didn't. So again, and, and I, I was trying to, I can't, she's she's getting kind of, she's taking stuff personal, even though it's not personal. So that's why I didn't want to direct it to her. But Dana says that, and no, it don't give a fuck. No, I, no one cares about what you being you. You're being something that the man wants. You're not just being you. You're curtailing yourself to what the fucking man you like likes. The bullshit about you getting chased and not chasing, again, bullshit. Because once a man that you like likes you, you're going to change in order to keep that man. Okay, that, that's bullshit. That's what I'm saying. So me as a man, though, is totally different. I'm going to say what the fuck I want to say. And I'm not concerned with a woman that don't like me because, again, I am the motherfucking prize. All right? The man is the motherfucking prize. If you don't like me, you know what I'm saying? I got plenty of options anyway. It's not the thing. I'm, I'm not, I'm not, I don't have to pursue that's what I'm saying. You on the other hand, you're in a different boat. So the whole thing of you saying this, this, this concept as where, oh, I'm just going to be me and that's going to cut it. And again, this isn't a shot, but this is all women in general. If that was the case, why are you single? That's what I'm just saying. If it worked like that, why are you single? And that's what I said. It's not personal. This is across the board for all the women that try to use that mentality. If that worked for you, you wouldn't be out here still on the market you be snatched up in, you know, with the man that wants you and you want him. So that's why mm -hmm. I'm elaborating and it just proved and steeled man my entire point. Because so of I that still, whole, I'm just going to be myself and I I'm going to be able to get the man I want and all this other mm -hmm. shit work, you wouldn't be single. But no, she, what she's saying, when you get to a certain age and mindset, you feel like you don't need to be in a space of competing. That's what it sounds like Dana's saying. When you're younger, well, well, Dana's up here, Dana's grown. And I, and okay, well, I, I, I don't know. I'm, I'm, what, I'm just going to say what I think. What, I think when you are younger, in your younger years, a lot of us women, we do be in a space where we are competing for a man's attention. As you get older and your mindset changes, you're not even thinking about that. You, you're exactly. Really not. You're, just, you're, you're not. Just, you're not you're saying, saying, I'm, 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 I'm am, competing today. I don't know about nobody else, but I'm single. I'm competing today. Is this thing on? It, I hear you. I got you. Today and tomorrow. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. So what? So what? I, 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 I hear. I, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I hear. Yeah, hold what, on. I, hold on. Well, well, it, it be, and hold on. Now, Nay, now Nay backtracking because Nay said she believed in competing earlier. Now she's saying she ain't competing. I said when it so, comes to our physical appearance, that we will be in a space of competition. When it nice. comes to our mindsets, we do not do that. But we were talking Nay, about the difference between the young and the older women. Yeah. She did. Nay, you're not listening. You prove fantastic point. You said, I'm not thinking about it. It's subconscious. You the market will tell you, what, what, Nay, the market will tell you if you're competing or not. If you are com if you are interested yes. in Enter the Black Dragon, exactly. it's not you that is saying, I'm competing for him. The fact that he might have two women around is going to make you compete for them. You don't choose to compete or not. You can get to a slot and the slot is open. Nobody's there. You don't have to compete. But if you like a man, there's very high probability that if you like a man, other woman like that man too. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. You don't decide to compete. You don't choose to compete. The market actually no tells choice. you to compete for the college, for the that, job, again, you for whatever you are to the final. You just, what well, Dana's saying is she's like, I'm just being myself. That's what she's saying. I'm just being and myself. And like, it's like, not working. Compete. And it's not working. <clears throat> okay, okay, okay. Let me get a friend to tell a friend. And we out.